again and welcome to Go Grandma Go, specially brought to you by TV Pendidikan. As always, Go Grandma Go will see two teams competing in four grammar games to get the highest points. Now, let's meet the contestants who are going to pit their grammar skills, intelligence and speed against each other. Let's give them a warm welcome from Sekolah Menengah Kebangsaan Bandar Utama Petaling Jaya. We have the And the team that is going to give them a run for their money is the green team from Sekolah Menengah Kebangsaan Bukit Bandaraya Kuala Lumpur. SMK Bandar Utama is represented by Nada Shazana Bukiti, Luis Adam Dengazi and Nui Bintibana Abi. Welcome. And the members of the green team from SMK Bukit Bandaraya are Sunanika and Dibu Zahir, Oliver Choa Chiyan, and Ali Bin Zutufi. And to all our faithful viewers of TV Pendidikan, welcome to... Go Ayana Go! The first game on Go Grammar Go today is called Words in Action. We are talking about action words. We also call them verbs. Verbs tell us what people, animals, or things do. Verbs can show actions in the past, present, or future. Okay, the yellow team will go first, and Nada Shazana, you're the first player. When you hear the buzzer, you'll have 60 seconds to read, decide on the best answer for each sentence, and drag the five uh, answers from the box to complete the sentences. Each correct answer earns you five points. Any wrong answers or unfilled blank gets you no points. So, are you ready? Yes. Okay, come on over. Okay, 60 seconds from now. Okay. Well, you have completed all your blanks. Let's look at your answers and see how you scored oh, on okay. the screen behind us. Congratulations. Well okay. done. Then that well means the yellow team now has... Well, it's time now for the green team to try and outdo the yellow team. And for that, we have Sunanika and Di Rosario. Okay. Are you clear about the rules? Yes. Okay, so do you think you can do better? I'll give it my best shot. Okay, are you okay. ready? Yes. Okay, come on over. 60 seconds. 60 seconds. From now. Done. And let's look at, let's look at the answers. Answer. Five points. And the now is twenty five points. Five points for the green team. Okay, teams, are you ready for the next game? Yes. All right, for the next game, come on over here, contestant number two from the game team, Oliver. Okay, our next game is called Names, Names, Names. We're talking about nouns. 
Nouns are the names of people, animals, things or places. And Herman will read a list of 10 questions to you and in 60 seconds you must try and answer all of them. If you do not know the answer, you just say next and he'll go on to the next question. And the faster you answer each one of them, the more chances you have of answering all 10. Each correct answer gets you 5 points. Uh, the buzzer will mark the start and the end of the game. Are you okay with the rules? Yes. Oliver, 60 seconds from now. Yep. The person in charge of the kitchen in a hotel is a chef. What do we call the person in charge of a hostel? Um, matron. A baby ant is called a grub. What do we call a baby fly? Uh, maggot. We call a group of rabbits a nest. What do we call a group of chickens? A brood. The sound made by a wolf is called a howl. What do we call the sound made by a mouse? Squeak. A king lives in a palace. Where does a monk live? Monastery. Apples grow on a tree. Where do grapes grow? A tree. A doctor who treats our teeth is called a dentist. What name do we give to a doctor who operates on people? Surgeon. Malaysians use the ringgit. What do the people of the Philippines use? Peso. A small river is called a stream. What do we call a small mountain? Hill. Sabah is known as the land below the wind. Which country is called the land of the rising sun? Japan. All right, well done. And let's check the answer. You got number one correct. Number two correct. Number three correct. Number four is also correct. Number five correct. Number six, the answer should have been fine. Number seven. Correct. Number 8, correct. Number 9, correct. And also number 10, correct. So the total score for your team now is 70 points. Well done. Okay, everyone, it's back to the yellow team and it's Moe's turn to try and outdo Oliver. Okay, Moe's, can we have you over here, please? Thank you. Do you still understand the rules? Yes, I do. Okay. I know we'll read you the questions as soon as the buzzer is sounded. The person in charge of an aeroplane is called a pilot. What do we call this person in charge of a ship? Captain. A young female horse is called a filly. What do we call a young male horse? Colt. We call a group of dolphins a school. What do we call a group of newborn kittens? Little. The sound made by a cock is called a crow. What do we call the sound made by an owl? Hoot. 